Hello again, everybody. It's me, Elric Ferris, Editor-in-Chief from Motherboards.org. Today, we take a look at one of the latest ATI4890 cards to hit the market. This is the new ASUS EAH4890 card. This card features one gigabyte of DDR5 memory, has six extensive heat pipe cooling for overclocking, and has new circuitry to make this card beyond any other card that's hit the market. This card is not a reference design. ASUS has spent very much time investing in the redesign of this card, bringing it to you for extreme overclocking. Follow along with us as we show you some of the finer points of this new card. Here we show you some of the basic specifications for the new ASUS EH4890 card. And for those people wanting to build themselves an HTPC, the card does feature HDMI. ASUS's new voltage tweak technology can offer 15% performance upgrades, and ASUS is the first company to offer this technology. One thing to take note of with the new ASUS EH4890 is it's not based on the standard reference design by ATI. They have used their own custom GPU to design this card. It has higher quality parts such as Super ML caps and a higher dedicated phase count for the GPU and memory. Here are some test scores from ASUS themselves comparing their new EAH4890 compared to a standard 4890. Here we show you a box shot of the retail package. And then we're going to move on into the driver CDs. And as you can see, the right hand side, we have all the adapters, as well as both the six pin and eight pin power connectors. These are the fans that help alleviate heat problems and cool the card itself. Here's both the six pin and eight pin connectors. Make sure you have a proper power supply with adequate power. These are the SLI bridges for when you use your card in SLI configuration. This is a nice shot of the rear of the card. This is the PCIe connection which inserts into the PCI Express slot in your motherboard. Here is the rear I.O. featuring dual DVI, one of which can be used in an HDMI configuration. Here is our test bed. Take note, we use the same test bed in all of our video card results for accurate comparisons. Here are some game shots from the actual card itself. Now let's see how this card did against its competitors. When it comes to the new ASUS EAH4890 card, all I can say is, wow. With this card's new cooling features, you can get up to 300% cooler temperatures than other cards when it comes to overclocking. For you people out there who like to push your card for as far as it can go, the new ASUS EAH4890 is the card that you should be looking at. This is an editor's choice product from motherboards.org, and I thank you for watching.